Seeing a whooping crane in Kansas is a big deal. Just ask John Rayside from Norman, Oklahoma, who drove to Quivira National Wildlife Refuge in hopes of seeing the fall passage. Come up to Quivira this time of year in November because it's the, getting to be the peak uh, crane migration. Migration in general, especially the whooping cranes, the you know, really good odds of seeing a whooping crane this time of year. Or Bill and Letha Fry of Kingman, who've spent several days at Cheyenne Bottoms away from their Kingman home to photograph these majestic birds. Birders come from everywhere to see these endangered animals, and Kansas is one of the few states where that's possible. Only about 327 wild whoopers exist today, up from the 14 that once rode the brink of extinction. They nest in Canada and winter in Texas, making the direct migration line through central Kansas a popular viewing location. The vast marshes of Quivira and Cheyenne Bottoms nearly always attract whoopers for a temporary stopover, but this year is even better than most. As many as 40 of the large birds have been spotted in central Kansas in this past week. Adult whooping cranes are white with black wing tips and red face masks. They stand about five feet tall. Juveniles are rusty red, and by fall migration, they are often dappled with white. Since they are carefully protected and colored somewhat like snow geese, hunting seasons are often suspended during their short stays. Fall whoopers migrate on north winds, so they tend to stay in place for a few days to catch the next front south. If you're lucky, you can get there in time to see these beauties. Currently, Cheyenne Bottoms has nearly 30 of the birds. Carl Grover, area manager at Cheyenne Bottoms, is keeping close watch on them. By far and away, the fall migration is when we attract uh, most of the whooping cranes. This year has been an exceptional year. Uh, we've had uh, reports of over 30 on the property at one given time. The most I've seen uh, myself at one, one sitting was 23. Uh, but this morning I had a report there were 27 and uh, right now we came, we're out right now and we only see uh, eight right now. In any case, when you get this uh, huge a number of uh, cranes on the one piece of property at one time, that's a pretty unique uh, opportunity and I think a lot of people have come from a long ways away to take advantage of it. Watch for whooping cranes in fall migration. They're a Kansas treasure. I'm Mike Blair for Kansas Wildlife and Parks.